Welcome back to Stellar Games. It's Dwellsy. I'm gonna dive into some episode two of No Man's Sky. I think I'm gonna try to accomplish getting the advanced laser uh, equipped on my mining beam. I'm gonna set up a base on every planet so that I can warp in and out to each planet as I please and uh, generally scavenge for more resources so that we can uh, make a get set to make a jump in the in the into an, another solar system or another system somewhere <sighs> could be a long one I don't know I'm gonna try let's see what happens let's warp into it there we go. <clears throat> Welcome back. Welcome back. Episode 2. So there's a few things that we need to uh, accomplish eventually here. You saw powering the base station. We need to get power going. I'm going to investigate the space station first now that we're here. It's going to take a, a little bit to investigate here, but we've got <clears throat> a lifetime of gameplay here anyway. Hmm. My hands close while I move. I didn't. Don't think I realized that before. So the space stations have changed a little bit since I started. What is this? Station core. Life support systems stable. Commercial monitoring online. Flight path management. Ninety-five percent efficiency. That's a surprisingly low number. Input override codes, one station over it. Huh. It sounds like the station is alive. It's breathing. Okay. Another time, dude. Let's take a look up on this side. Before we go over to what I think is the main side, I think. I'm not sure. Over there. Gonna check out everything, grab everything. Nanites. Let's let's learn languages and like I wanna try to pick up a different uh, uh, mining tool. So we're gonna talk to people even if we don't know what's going on yet. Scrap dealer, what's going on? Okay, so he's speaking in uh, Corvax. Don't know those words yet. So we're going to learn those words. The life form awaits behind their terminal. They look me up and down and seem to decide I am not a customer. They do not look particularly helpful. Well, let's see. Ask about other travelers. The life form looks at me with alarm before waving me away. Okay, so we're, we're not ready for that yet. Uh, let's start down... What's that? Is that anything? Encrypted something. Come on. Navigation data, cool. What's this? Starship outfitting, purchase improvements, salvage ship. This is different. Drones deployed to target starship Radiant Pillar BC-1. Available operations, upgrade class and or storage or melt ship into scrap. Okay, well I don't want to do that. So that's unavailable. Upgrade, where do I find upgrades? Use this outfitting station to increase the size of the starship inventory or improve it, its base stats by upgrading its class. Okay. Upgrades to specific functions such as weapon, uh, weapons and engines can be purchased from technology merchants, which I'm assuming is in this starship somewhere, uh, the starbase. Uh, drones deployed, okay. Do I have any upgrades? Just, you know. Augment inventory storage or improve starship class? Improve storage for free with storage augmentation units. Okay, which I obviously don't know a million units or... Oh my goodness. Okay, we don't have any of that. Noobs. Moving on, let's see what this guy's got to say. Oh, exosuit upgrade? Yes? 5,000 units to upgrade. Install a new slot. Yeah. Yes. 
That's handy McDandy. Is that anything? Okay. Oh, he's a technology merchant. Okay, life form waits behind there. Yeah, you know, okay, I'm not a customer still, apparently. Not very helpful. We'll just leave. Uh, another time when we understand your language. Another technology merchant. Okay. What do you think? Probably doesn't want to talk to us either. The metallic being chatters away, pouring forth words in a language I cannot understand. But when I blink, I see that the same red lights that stared at me in the distress beacon. Ooh, repeat 16. We are watching you, traveler friend. Find what we have left you. Are you find we left? Anyway, find what we left you. Okay. Weird. Though the alien speaks, the words are not their own. A string of code is echoed back to me uh, through the red glare, logged directly to my exosuit. The crimson light fades away, and I see the life form staring at me through its, through its visor. Whatever has happened, they do not appear to have seen it. I should leave. Perhaps my base computer would be able to make something of this code. Okay. So I should go back to the base computer. Okay, yeah. Every system has a space station serving as its hub, speaking to life forms abroad the or sorry aboard the station brings the chance to trade learn words or gain stand standing visit technology merchants to upgrade your ship and equipment visit the cartographer for directions to outposts and other buildings take missions from the mission agent to learn valuable rewards uh use the teleporter to instantly return to your base okay no oh, we're not going to do that quite yet it's on the other side anyway let's uh, keep going Okay, mm-hmm. Oh, say Corvax, yeah, understood that word. Purchase upgrade modules. Launch us, oh, upgrade modules for the ship. I have 23,000 units. Launch thruster module, what does this do? Moderate upgrade to the starship thr uh, launch thrusters. Uh, the module is flexible and exact. Upgrade statistics are unknown until installation is complete. Potential improvements include launch efficiency and speed. Okay. Uh, 69 units, Lamau. Oh, they were for nanites, not money. Right, okay, I can't purchase anything else right now then for nanites. That seemed like a good uh, purchase anyway. So... Upgrade modules improve the specific technology you have already installed. Each module is unique. Search out specific or rare, rare modules at each space station. Upgrading modules are ready-made and require no crafting. Use nanites to buy upgrades from space station technology merchants. Each upgrade is unique. Check every space station for rare upgrades. Every core technology can support three upgrade modules. Okay. Alright, so that means we can upgrade the ship then? Upgrade module acquired. Open the inventory to begin installation of the upgrade module. For the ship, though. Wasn't it? Oh, okay. Moderate upgrade, not known. Hold A to install in the launch tester or just in an open slot? Oh, okay. Is that correct? Is that how it's done? Launch cost minus 6%. Boost 1%. Okay, for now, sure. That'll save some fuel on launching. Cool. Uh, where were we? Somewhere around this guy. What's this? Oh, is this where we get the gun? Yeah. What, what you got? It looks, it looks expensive. What does it have? The visor, the scanner, the mining beam, and a ricochet module. Class B. So let's compare. So our current one has some stuff as well. 
a million units to outright buy it to exchange it. It has a ton more slots, obviously, but I I would get fifty-six thousand for that one, and it cost a million. And I don't, I don't have that. Uh, that's too bad. Okay, we'll come back for you. What do you got to say? Quarterbacks. Okay, so we'll need we'll need the nanites. Mining being bullcaster, so that's for our mining technology. Multi-tool upgrade. Augment technology slots or improve multi-tool class. Add slots for free with multi-tool expansion slots. So we can't do any of that right now. Oh, so I could just purchase a new slot now and again, or 10,000 nanites. Okay. Uh, there's that. And... What's in here? Analyst. Corvax. The Corvax is busy with strange, with a strange enterprise. They appear to be scanning the floor, though their reason for doing so is unclear. Request for dive or land. Let's, uh, I think this is asking to learn a word. Analyst entity presents a list of symbols, each seeming to represent a word I might learn. Aggression, mystery, technology, or Corvax. Well, let's, let's learn about Corvax. Teaches me the word for their language. I learned Traveler. Cool. Grab some carbon while I'm here. Hello then. Uh, I need to back up because you're super ugly. Okay. Oh my goodness. I demand a place on your throne world, interloper. Acceptance will be will grant you the glory of an exos, exocraft and a Viking mech priest to administer its mass. Okay, conscript dude. Pray only that you have an exocraft terminal sufficient for my skills. Refusal refusal will result in my inevitable extermination. Be quick. Okay, that sounds like I have to build an exocraft terminal and this guy will work at it. The technician seeks to work, yeah, claiming that they will be able to build an upgrade exocraft. Okay, so we'll decline the offer for now. Sorry about your execution. The Viking seems dangerous and unstable. I should show caution before interviewing them to live in my home. <laughs> yeah. Probably. What you got? An electronic life form a life form's bright greeting suddenly slows. They tap into personal data while their facial lights dilate and internal systems crash. Columns of streaming data show their power levels spiraling downwards. Well, that doesn't sound good. Corvax. The life form looks at me for help, and they point towards gathered resources with a single slow and desperate movement. So we can give carbon or ferrite dust. Uh, 75 carbon? Slowly, painfully, the entity inserts the element into their slot on their, in, on their hip. Gradually, power returns to their shell. The Corvax nods politely, though they seemed a little embarrassed to have made the request. They gift... Uh, they give a gift of their own. Oh, a hun over 100 nanites. Increased standing with Corvax. Okay, cool. Galactic terminal. Let's see if there's anything we can sell. I don't think we need this right now. It's not really worth much anyway. Uh, radon. Silicate powder. Uh, I'll just sell this for now. Mm. I don't 
don't think I need salt for anything right now. It makes chlorine, but I don't think I need that right now. And uh, I don't need that for now. Forgive me, I've been searching for such a long time. I am contracted to aid you and this is in this and every cycle. Don't worry, everything was paid for a long time ago. It's all quite above board. Okay. As the stranger speaks, a smell assaults me. A pheromone infesting my brain, giving me memories of places I never visited, of actions I never took. Of myself in a mirror, <coughs> aged and alone, of this geck cradling their fallen brethren of a bargain made many years from now a contract signed across the cosmos the vision ends and the overseer remains the overseer promises to explain my expand my base allowing me to recruit other workers they require a construction terminal to get started okay i need a couple different terminals though. i do not feel comfortable hiring this geck i will later though I saw another door down here, which I think I need an atlas pass. Probably level three? Yeah, V3. Okay. We'll get to that. I need to get to uh, an atlas. Uh, okay, let's check out the other side. And we'll be able to maybe even buy a better ship later from one of these guys and take one of those nice ships. Alright, here's the main side. Let's look at... Uh, let's look at uh, what's going on here. Let's talk to people. Research entity. Corbex. Traveler. Let's see learning words. The electronic life form seems to be in a high spirits. They gesture towards their chests, apparently making me an offer. Okay, I'm gonna keep asking for words. Alright, they give me the list of symbols. Let's go for friendship symbol. Ehu, I don't know what that is. Is that even English? Okay. What about you? Can help me or not. The warriors move and indicate that their ancestors are not currently insulted. They make friendly barking noises. Okay. Uh, they swing their arms, performing dramatic series of actions that represents words I might learn. Uh, let's go with the Viking symbol. We learned the word for Viking. Cool. Let's do that again. Ah, see, Viking, yeah, we learned that word. Alright, still making nice barking noises. Let's get a let's get a word from a list. Uh what is the aggression symbol? I don't normally pick that, but he is a warrior. Oh, I learned the word for death. You seem pretty happy about that. What about you? Corvax Traveler. High spirits. Uh, I already. Oh, did I already learn from him specifically? Sorry, sorry to bother you. Mission agent. Uh, oops. Oh, can I not click? What does he do? Oh, it's just leave. Sorry. Envoy. I have seen this alien's insignia before. They are a member of the Explorer's Guild. 
They do not seem interested in the data I have to offer. Perhaps the mission listing agent on the on the station might have a waypoint to prove my worth. Okay. Which is I learned five words. Go me. I'm multilingual. The Corvax looks up, swiftly scans me, and then reveals their catalog of maps and charts. Mm, traveler? No word for traveler? No, I'm a traveler. Ask for help. Exchange for the purchase random map. I'm gonna ask for help. Uh, they point to a map on their screen, then towards a depiction of a waypoint tower, of the waypoint towers found in the most planetary sites. They seem to be requesting I gather data from these towers. Okay. All right, we gotta go find towers and build stations in our base for hiring people. And can I learn from you? Teach me. He snarls but does so differentially make it clear that they are willing to talk to me learn me uh, prefect Laga nods thoughtfully then presents a list of the symbols uh, let's go with mystery symbol I learn a word of their language for the Okay. Oh, I can't. I can't learn from you. Okay. Uh, portal. What about you? You're not walking around. Come. Technician. What are you for hire? Uh, focused on my mask, lights in my visor. Oh, yes. Yeah, learn a word. Technician asks something incomprehensible. I stare blankly. Finally, they present a selection of simple glyphs. Uh, concepts of words I might learn. So let's learn a technology symbol. For research. Cool. We learned research. Uh, what about you? The trader appears tired and frantic trying to draw me into some kind of transaction. Learn me a word. Hire asp produces a data pad as they were as though they had prepared for this moment they present a selection of symbols each representing a type of geck word I might learn uh, friendship uh, for help cool thanks dude alrighty then now I think that's enough exploring for now we've got a lot of work to do oh look at that another milestone eight words. Normally, I would be thinking, like, let's take the teleporter directly back to the base? Hmm. We have some things to build. Do, or do I take the spaceship fly home? Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Let's take the, the teleporter, right? Yoink! This should zip us right to your selected base of... Right, Stellar Games EP1. That is our base. Crisp weather, yeah. Isn't it like minus 50? Uh, Sentinels are regular patrols. There were even Sentinels on there? Okay. Let's go there. Yowza! We'll be there in a minute. Back at home. Okay. <sighs> what do we need to do? What do we need? There's no real hints here. Let's construction research. We need to build other modules to hire people. So, is it structures? It's, it's, no, no, no. no. Mm, we do need some of this. I think we have everything we need for now. 
let's let's just power this for a moment because it... technology recharge. Okay. I just wanted to get rid of that message that keeps popping up about powering the station. Okay. We gotta find towers, we gotta Build bases. So our ship is here. That's good. It automatically teleport. Visit the base computer. Okay, right. Bop boop. Archives terminated. Select new task. Begin decryption. Decoding. 16, 16, 16. Message follows. The traveler finds their wings. Fly to us and claim your place among the stars. Really? Possible distress signal. Okay. Reach the decoded coordinates. Okay. Is it on this planet? Should I walk or fly? It doesn't say that it's off planet. Setting out. I've traveled 8,000 units. Okay. Uh, we'll zip on over there. See you in a second. Started attacking me. I don't. New item recorded. Scaly meat. Gross. Like, sorry about your loss, but don't attack me. You know. Uh, what are these things? You know, oh, frost crystals. Hazmat. Right. 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 God, that is so creepy. That they just unanimate. <laughs> it's, that's it. Okay, we're still trying to make it up into that ledge right there. Hopefully uh, we don't get too many more dinosaurs chasing us along the way. Like his girlfriend over there. Okay. Uh, we're still a little ways away. Go. Charging here, what's going on? Technology recharge. Where's my where's my my gun? Where's it? Bah! Hey, you too. Why is everything so hostile all of a sudden? Stop hostile. Where did that other one run to? I think it's up there. Well, let's get our scanner out and this. Protection falling. 
seems to be in this direction. Okay. Let's keep going. What's this? Alright, wow. Big hole. Alright, let's keep going. Wow, look at that structure. What is that? Is that a huge starship? Oh my goodness. Look at the size of that thing. Let's see what that is. Okay. Now the game's telling me to, to signal for my, my ship, but I, I'm just gonna walk this one out. Caves real quick here. Interesting. They just instantly go deep. What is that? Yeah, you're coming for me. Yeah, they just don't learn. Okay. Wow, ah, look at that thing. I'm fine with that for now. basically here. Look at the size of this thing. Still walking up to it. It's massive. Really interesting with the, the floating uh, islands of, of uh, like chunks of land up in the air. Look at this thing. I've never seen this before. up to the top to see if we can see how high I don't know if we can jump all the way up there but get a better vantage point. We've traveled ten thousand Ks. Wow, we jumped up. <laughs> oh my goodness. We are at the top. Wow. Okay. Look at the size of this thing. Let's go see what's down there. Gently.
Hello? Is anybody out? Uh, I'm pretty sure that guy just hit this the ship. That's a landing zone for my ship. Okay, let's check this out. MS Wings of the Anomaly. Log damaged. Partial records available. The signal has led me to the wreck of the freighter. Colossal fragments of metal shattered across the landscape. Were these messages nothing but the misfiring circuits of a long-forgotten ruin? Nestled among the debris, I find the pilot's log, blinking, awaiting input. Gimme! Instead of displaying the ship's log, the terminal spits out a strange sequence of numbers. They are followed by a short message. The anomaly comes from the stars. Take flight. A schematic of the hyperdrive is attached to the end of the message. Take it. Pull the blueprint from the computer, but this hyperdrive blueprint is for a conventional starship, not a freighter of this size. Someone placed this here after the crash, hoping it would be found. Yeah, sounds like something we could use. Chromatic metal, that's uh, processed copper, and a microprocessor. We have one. So th Right. The hyperdrive light speed warp drive will help us get into different systems. So the FTL propulsion drive that allows Starship to attain warp speed and jump between neighboring systems. User is advised to access hyperdrive systems through the galactic map. Awesome. Recommendations. Install the hyperdrive. Installing hyperdrive into Starship will allow long distance and interstellar travel. Begin hyperdrive installation. Acquire components, purchase microprocessors, acquired components, refine chromatic metal, and finalize the installation. Alright. And in order to do that, uh, we're going to the quick menu to summon our ship. Quick menu. Summon. Five of those, so let's find copper. We gotta purchase microprocessors. Hmm. Okay, let's find copper first, though. Still. Where's the copper? Alright, well it wants us to go to the space, space station anyway. Let's just go to the space station. I'm flying. Head over this way. Boost. Go 
get us some microchips. Resources to be able to buy it, so let's see if we can sell some more stuff. Need quite a bit. Might have been a wasted trip. Uh, exosuit. Yeah, we're gonna need lots of money. So, silver, let's sell the silver. We'll sell the gold, not the nuggets. Those hyper clusters, and we'll sell the platinum. There we go, that gives us enough money. However, oops, did I take those by accident? Let's process these where I get. Processors, of course. Uh, processors. Need four. Okay. Refined chromatic metal. So we gotta go get some some copper. Space trucker. <laughs> and a trader. Cool. And a money maker. Cool. Well, I think we know what we need to do there.
for sure. See if we can save up for maybe a new starship or something. Come on. Come on. All right. Let's get to our friendly planet down here to uh, get some copper. something we could land on. Nope. Maybe. Well, it's something you can hit and get stuck on, though. <laughs> Oopsies. Okay. Let's scan for things. First things first, let's go up there. Must be the thing that entity was talking about. All the terminus activated, network traffic low, access records. There are no incoming calls currently registered with the holo terminus. Logs from the previous calls are available. Access the logs. Corvax, 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 Corvax. There was something interesting about these towers at one point. Something happens. Maybe not right now. Alright, let's uh, see what's in here. Us, but I don't want it attacking. Nanites. We. Look for copper. Like that one. A 
any others that were closer? That's 600. See you there in a minute. Lots in the old inventory. Let's just make sure of that. Double check. So, what we don't need is this geode. And anything else we can break down, like a crystal fragment. Get a bunch of dihydrogen in there. And I think we're okay to receive copper. suit upgrade building and a copper deposit in the same direction. Let's get this back into a protect, protect me mode. And uh, let's go see what that is over there. Cool. These pods have definitely changed since I started. They were a lot smaller, I think? You just come on up in here and grab an upgrade. Missing component, antimatter housing. Huh. one can't make one. So how do I... deposit this way? That wasn't the one I marked, was it? I'm sure there was another one. I just saw it. It's this way. Alright. Can I... Can I set a waypoint here? Or? 
Maybe one of those save stations right here, or... Uh, build menu? I don't want to put a base here or anything. Just... Hmm. some more copper over here. Alright, it turns out the copper's a little farther away than I thought. I was gonna grab another one, but let's just go to the ship. Save again. Okay, so we'll get that suit up and we'll just get a refiner, get the materials we need for our hyperdrive. Let's go back and get our metal and get that installed. Gotta watch out for those sinkholes. Go to the hyperdrive, install the chromatic metal, and the processors. That should be a big one. Hyperdrive installed. Alright. And we need warp cells and warp hypercores. So, let's look at making a warp cell. Out there. I need a warp cell. So I need to get antimatter housing. Uh, 
Cool, Just found that real quick. Oxygen regenerator. And do we analyze that? Okay. Okay, let's go get, oh, we got antimatter somehow. Let's get antimatter housing. I guess we'll go buy one. Diagnostics report hyperdrive successfully installed. Cool. Hyperdrive fuel status empty. Not cool. My hyperdrive is complete. Perhaps I really want to find answers out there amidst the, amidst the stars. But without warp cells, I will be going nowhere. I need to find the source of antimatter. Tune scanner to antimatter. Search for antimatter traces with the starship scanner. from orbit it says. <laughs> okay, well we gotta go up there anyway. Let's get an antimatter housing. Oh god. Let's navigate through this. Still need an antimatter housing. <sighs> Please have some.
might have to wait for somebody to trade with. to buy some, some upgrades. Uh, it was on the other side that I wanted to be. <laughs> Installable multi grid up tools. Let's purchase some upgrade modules. Uh, mining beam module. This is uh, power output, heat tolerance, and fuel efficiency. Uh, scanner module, bolt caster plasma, geology cannon, javelin. Do we have an advanced? So that's plasma. Scatter blaster. Okay, well, we'll get the mining beam. Of course. Why would we have free stocks? We need to sell some stuff, which is on the other side. Gosh darn it. Any other ships that want to do trades in this system or what? Don't do that. Okay, so we don't really need cobalt right now. Uh, useful manufacturing ion batteries, but we don't need it right now. Navigation data we're keeping. Nope. thousand worth of silver right there. Our little yes, mining received. escapade. Another fifty thousand in platinum. Yes, uh, another hundred eighty nine thousand in gold. Yes, right on.
antimatter housing. Come on. How do you do that? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I bet. Let's go get the antimatter. And maybe there's something we can find for the housing. thrusters at. They're still good for a bit. Okay. Let's hit it. Oh, they got some uranium here too. It's that, it's that moon. say approximate location so let's check out this area here cool so it's radiation outside 6.6 .6 rads So suit's good for now. Alright. Save. Scans. shy so they're fine. Eggs. Are they dangerous or do I gather them? Or? Oh god. Oh god. Okay, what you don't do is shoot them apparently.
get rid of this. Alright, let's see what happens. Terminal online. Selecting key. Decrypting. Hello, Dave. The terminal is clogged with an unnerving, pulsating slime. Nevertheless, it appears to function. As I touch the input panel, the alien substance reacts violently. I make a note to avoid getting closer. <laughs> the device opens, revealing a single, unblinking crimson eye. It prints out a blueprint for antimatter, accompanied by a strange message. Okay, take it and read. You will find us when the time is right. 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16. Okay. I need condensed carbon and chromatic metal to make antimatter. Okay. I've got that. I got that in spades, yo. Okay, there's stuff over here with that. Gimme. I want knowledge. This is knowledge. Gimme this. Craft antimatter and then assemble an antimatter housing. Okay, are you gonna show me how to do that though? Maybe that's all I needed. I was running around the universe and it's gonna just show me. Give me this though. <sighs> Probably too much slime and crap and junk and crap. Okay, I'm sorry, my controllers are almost up. Are those things still inside? It sounds gross in here. Hero? Oh, you can hit me from there? I can hit you from here too. There's a lot of them out here, isn't there? They mad. Oh man, they're, they're, they're coming. There's so many of them. The last one? No. Those whispering eggs, they're really nasty. Wow. That sucked. Oh, I can just make it? Uh, oh, come on. Need more oxygen. Okay, so I need a lot of oxygen to make those. So that means I need. I can make fuel now, yes. You, uh, make another one? I need another antimatter, which I can make. I can make another one? <laughs> okay, can I make another one? Okay. Can I just. Wow, that only gave me two jumps doing all that work. Okay, I need more condensed carbon, which I can refine, of course. This is not a very great place to be, though. I don't like this place. Uh, let's look around a little bit with our...
building over here, apparently. I think that, is that just one of them, one of them beacons? And what's that? A waypoint. Minor settlement. Okay. Yeah, we need stuff like that. Though we'll find technology and other such things. What? settlement. Let's refuel. Technology recharge. minutes away, let's boost. Go uh, orbital a little bit here. Atmosphere thin out. That other planet's really close too, isn't it? Oh, of course, we're on a moon. Okay, let's let's get out here and boost. Okay, so we can use the galactic map and stuff now. It says. In space, access the galaxy map from the quick menu, move along specific paths, or browse to choose your own route. Go, go this way more. Warping requires warp fuel and your hyperdrive. Some systems require hyperdrive upgrades to access. Okay. We'll warp to another system. Okay, we're not going to be in a huge hurry. We still want some resources and other things to help us. Let's get to this settlement first. Oh, look at this place. Another destroyed ship. Okay. We'll go over to the settlement and we'll walk over to this and see if there's any damage to anything. Oh, what's that over there? Right over there. Okay, settlements are good. buildings.
Stop it. I need Another dinosaur. Alright, let's see what's in here. Huge gun. Come on, controller. Probably a million bazillion dollars. Look at all the slots. 1.6 million units. Wow. So much damage. Holy crap. Yeah, so I really need it. So I only have 500,000, so we can do a lot of mining in space and get that back up again. Oh, 
that's the outside. What's in here? Oh, that's my ship. Okay, what do you got? Technology merchant. Let's purchase... Let's see what the components you got. Oh, you got an antimatter housing, you... Quantum computers, Jillian. Yeah, those were things that I needed. Uh, let's see what blueprints you have. Advanced mining laser, thank you very much. A teleport receiver shipment. Ooh. A device module uh, modulates standard starship communications signals enable to enable the t transport of matter as well as data. I need antimatter and a wiring loom. I knew I needed a wiring loom. Okay. Uh, waveform recycler. Increases potential scan frequencies. Right, don't need that yet. Show this. Okay, we don't need some of these yet. Alright. Wiring. I was gonna buy one just in case, but. To buy. You just had one. into the personal yeah we've seen that before life form looks at me for help and then they point to my gathered resources I'm gonna give you ferrite dust this time I give you carbon last time slowly painfully puts it into their hip there is no effect the lights go out <laughs> sorry fresh logs being downloaded now empty metal shell this new entity ignores me Sorry, can I do it again? No. You don't like me anymore. Copper? Oh, no. it was just a little copper deposit. Whoa, that digs into a. <laughs> okay.
Oh, there's a phone call there. And go. See what this ship is about real quick. And might radiation protection I might just do what the game suggests and just warp to another system. This has been a pretty harsh system to deal with with all the dinosaurs attacking and the uh, uninhabitable or like the rough planets that we gotta go through here. Is that a plant or a beast? It's a beast! Who would have who would have thunk? How do those legs work? Available. My love, I dive into the black hole tomorrow. I know we agreed not to. I warn them about advisability of such a large vessel moving through the rift, but they are arrogant, vain creatures. Are they not? We emerged into the skies above. Reality itself has Reality itself has abdicted here. Vast hexagons litter the landscape of this once proud planet, now become the plaything of our un unseen foe. I fear I will not be back home for time. We drank the water. My love, forgive me. Okay. Salvage materials from the wreck.
cargo pods sound good. Where did that leak come from? That was unreal. Technology offline. Oh, I gotta go back to where I died to recover my stuff. Okay. Crap. Not without my ship this time, I don't. Well, that was incredibly annoying. So let's go check it out, but like... I don't actually want to drop down there again. That's the problem. My controllers are a little messed up. Radiation protection. Hey, stop. Thank you. 
Radiation protection falling. Yeah, as soon as you open that, you get a leak. Like, super radioactive all of a sudden. Okay. Uh, is that all the cargo? I mean, that's all I want to check out. Oh. Another cargo pod over there. Let's go see. And then we're getting out of here. Kinda sorta need it all. Radiation protection falling. Yeah, you really have to get away from that thing. It hurt too bad. All right, let's get the heck out of here. system. <sighs> Let's go into space. This, this system has a ton, a ton of planets, but I, I don't want to keep checking them all because they're really hostile here. Let's just get out of this region. Like, there's nothing cool really left to discover here. Solid copper, yeah. I think we got everything we need to get the heck out of here, so let's see what it's saying. Do we do from the quick menu? Access the galactic map. Oh my goodness. So this has changed different uh, since the last time I've seen it too, so free look, waypoint, and leave. Right B is free look. So we can go to that system to get out to these systems. Uh,
Wow, okay, so that's deep already. This is a little different than what I was used to. So what's what's that then? Obviously I can't go way out there, but uh current location. Corvax scientific. Yeah, see buying stuff was expensive, selling it conflict was tranquil. Alright, uh, sure. Okay, let me just... I don't think I did that right. <laughs> filter mm, okay or oh I can't get to my controllers messed up and I can't move it properly so free explore or galactic core that's that's our choices. I want to get to an atlas station. Okay. Well, we do need to get to the galactic core anyway. Can we not get there? Oh dear. We need to we need to figure that out. The left A does not seem to set the waypoint. Okay. I just needed to enter free look. Now left A, can I set the waypoint now? Apparently. Yeah. Whoa. Warp in there. All right, this is going to take a minute. Zippity zap, here we are in the new system. system malfunctioning. Uh oh. Searching for other routes. So that means warping through damaged my ship maybe? <sighs> We've got... Searching, searching, searching for routes. Obtained. Rerouting. Destination 16, 16, 16, 16. <laughs> One, six. Okay. Accept new guidance. Sure. Guidance accepted. Plotting route. A fuel source right over there. Okay, guess what? The space station's right over here. We're gonna 
go to the space station. Oh, there's a huge planet right behind us. And we're gonna save it and come back for a third episode, I think. Because I think we've. Uh, crap. So, when that happens, we should get the heck out of here. Yeah, that's the other thing. We don't want to get any fights right now with our wimpy little ship. So they'll scan our cargo and then shoot us and take our cargo. If we had the more valuable your cargo, the more they're going to want to do that. Look at how much tritium we have. There's a bunch of copper. Uh, it doesn't look like anything's really broken. But look at all, look at some of the stuff we've got in here. It would be valuable. A little bit. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna save it there. Follow Starship Guidance when we get back. Uh, we've got a new space station to explore. And, um... I guess, I guess that's it for now. We'll see you in episode three. Bye for now.